Hey guys, and welcome back to Alone in the Dark. And my god, it's been a week since I've played this game. Uh, yes, we want to climb the ladder. We got a nice juicy um, info dump in the last video about how the ooh, company set everything up. We found a huge, or should I say the history of the uh, Obed Morton Empire. Uh, we also got a huge bag of shotgun shells, which was fantastic. Ah, we appear to be on the outside. This is good. You know, it's... Even now, it's surprising me. Wow, dude. Fuck. Just how lush these... Um, these scenes are. They look gorgeous. I don't know if they look this good on the PlayStation. I'm going to say they probably mostly did. I don't know. But absolutely fantastic stuff here. Okay. Let's keep exploring. So we we were trying to get into Obed Morton's uh, office to look for information on these statues, if I remember correctly. Oh. Okay. Box of grenades. We like boxes of grenades in these parts. Uh, we must actually have a fair stack of grenades by now. We've got 25 of the puppies. Not bad. Oh, and we're carrying our um, empty handgun around as well, which probably not, you know, super bright. Okay, anything else here? There's got to be more than that here, surely. Like, you know, this. Can we not go down this door here? No, I guess not. All right. Like, that is something, surely. Uh, it looks like some sort of rig that someone set up. Oh, uh, right. Let's, no, can't use that. Can't use that. Really? That's... No way. There's got to be something else in here. There has to be something else in here. I'm not buying that there's, you know, nothing here. It has to be. Right? Surely? I mean, that looks like a rig for something. Are those just grenades in here? Which, okay, fine. That's, you know, very nice. But... That kind of looks open, but I guess there's nothing actually in there that we can fondle with. Very strange. We can't even, like, go out of that window. There's no prompt. There's no information. There's nothing. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So I guess we're going to go back down. Is there anywhere else we can go here? There has to be more than grenades there. I mean, nah, man. Um, no. Uh-uh. Really? That's it? Yeah, see that? In theory, <clears throat> that should lead to where we started. In fact, that does lead to where we started. And then we've got that gate there that we can't open. But it's flashing orange, and I can't remember what orange flashing things mean. Um, shit. Nah, okay, so we're kind of... Oh, hang on. Uh, can we... All right, there's no torch here or anything. I can't believe we can't go down here. Like, that just seems a bit strange to me. <clears throat> I mean, sure, it's, um, you know, covered up in, in stuff, but you would have thought that, you know. Um. Oh, what is this notebook stuff about? Oh, hang on. Can't be suspected. Obed Morton to be his friend's murderer. I must find him before he does. I must also find those uh, Abkansas writing tablets. Kambi is in the gardens. Rendezvous in the manor. Uh, we haven't seen Kambi for a while, actually. Met Obed Morton's mother. She is paralyzed and half blind. Half blind? I thought she was totally blind. Believes her son is in great danger. She gave me a key that has something to do with a statue in the museum. 
Oh, it actually says there, a statue in the museum. Didn't she say it was in the smoking room? Which didn't make a lot of sense to me. She also talked about Obed's father, Howard Morton. Eve dropped on a conversation between Obed and an unknown person. The latter is suspicious that Obed betrayed him with a person named Lamb. They also talked about guinea pigs. Yeah, guinea pigs. The people they've been experimenting on. Um, I guess that's Alan. I have found Obed, but he's running away from me. Prisoner! Obed has put me to sleep. Called Carnby for help. Carnby bailed me out, but I'm still suspicious about him. Um, why? I must talk to Obed before he finds him. Obed got knocked out in front of me by an unknown person. Confirmation that Obed is in touch with this person named Lamb. Who is Alan? Two agents? Carnby and I? Well, yes. Uh, have I dreamt? I saw a mirror, the face of a man that calls himself Deserto. He asked me to get him back. To get him back his mirror. He also mentioned a person named Edenshaw. Met Edenshaw. He pretends, pretends to be the last shaman. What do you mean he pretends to be the last shaman? He told me he needs seven statues to accomplish a ritual that will destroy the lair of darkness. Edenshaw suggested that I should visit Obed's office. Statues are animal-like. Uh, yeah, so... Okay, I mean, right, fair enough. I guess we can't really do anything here, which is really weird. Also, those uh, grenade rounds weren't showing up. They weren't flashing at us, so... Are they a Brucey bonus? I don't know. Nothing we can do with that. This just seems strange that there's nothing of any substance here, you know? That's really, really bizarre, but okay. I guess for now, let's go back into the library. Oh, yeah, isn't there like an area here where she's like, don't got time to read? Like, excuse me. Excuse me. We've just read a Bible, so... I don't know what you mean by you don't have time to... Uh, oh! Ratchets. I don't know what exactly she means by that. Oh! Uh... Okay... Can we move those? Uh, right, uh, okay, so puzzle time, I guess, but uh, a puzzle with no context. I'm guessing we have to move all of these things. Wait, check for more scratches, I wonder. The sweet FA up there. How do we fiddle with stuff? Right, that one's open. We've been in there, haven't we? Yes. Yes, we did. Because, uh, oh yeah, there's... Ah, right, there's that thing there. But I guess we need to find something for that. Another one of those statues. Uh, what, another one of those things. Okay. So... Can we do that now? I mean, we've got this thing here, which looks like a load of buttons to push. Right. But... We can't push any buttons with it. So, I don't know, Chief. Okay. Okay, so there's definitely something more to do in here. Now, can we actually examine that statue thing on the floor? So we've got a puzzle in here. We know that we need to find an item, I guess. And also have a closed 
hidden door. Wait, do we need to turn the light off? Is that a thing? The statue is much older than everything else. Oh, yes. Right, what happens if we do indeed turn the light off? Let's see if this accomplishes anything. I mean, I've got my doubts. I have my serious doubts, but we're kind of, I mean, I don't want to say we're out of ideas, Chief, but, you know, we're out of ideas, Chief. Let's get up here. I mean, I don't think this is going to change. Well, there's mirrors and things up here, I suppose, isn't there? So. Uh, okay. Anything that's going to, like, glint at us? Maybe. Does this change anything in here? No, because it's still lit up in here. Okay. That's fine, I guess. Oh! The light switch in there as well. Which is... Curious. No, it still doesn't look like there's much of anything here, you know? Nothing behind, like, the tapestry or anything. No, nothing that we can play with anyway. Uh, okay, cool, fine, fair. Um, and we still can't play with that. That's the biggest fuck factor, I think. In fact, there's obviously, like, a key panel there. Uh, but we can't fiddle with it. It's just, um, it's just odd, I think. So, what happens now? We go all the bloody way back up here. Right. So that does indeed actually shine light down on that statue. Right? But, there's... There's nothing we can do. Uh, I mean, the middle of that um, floor kind of, I mean, if you squint at it funny and, you know, you use a healthy dose of imagination and, and you go into an extreme caffeine and nicotine withdrawal, it kind of looks like a prism and we have a prism but there's nowhere to put a prism you see you see the problem here right uh mm, okay yeah i don't think that's it chief but i mean we can fiddle i suppose there's nothing else obvious in here you know yeah this looks like a prism that we're standing on here not even that dark in here uh, that's gonna be the book that we've already... Yeah, uh-huh. Oh dear, dear, oh dear. I don't want to fiddle with that. Statue's much... Oh, she just says it's much older than anything else. Uh, we know that. Oh. Put like a prism in its chest or something? Hmm. No. 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 Alright, well, I guess there's nothing we can do here then. I mean, we tried, guys. We tried. We really did. Alright. Uh, so, let's go back out here. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ on a motorbike. Uh. Uh, gun? Can you work, please, gun? I like my guns when they work, and they give the shooty bang bang. Really? You're a tough fucker. Now... That was a humongous waste of resources. 
probably, but they were in a horrible, uh, confined space there. Wow, we only have one of these. Ouch. That's, that's not really good. Uh, okay, so, I mean, that takes us back into there. So, where is Morton's offices? Oh, God, we've got those bloody things. I think this leads back upstairs, doesn't it? Yeah, this leads into the weird light room. Now, have a I think we can go in here now. Can. Oh. Uh, aren't you supposed to be like afraid? I guess they're supposed to be afraid, but they're not afraid. All right. So. I mean, his office was... Hear that? Definitely heard something there. Okay. Yeah, so... I think his office was down here. Uh. Yeah, we've read that, haven't we? Eden Shaw and I. Yeah, we've read all that. Right, I think what we're going to do here, guys, I'm going to try and find out what we're supposed to be doing. Because I have no ideas, dude. Okay, 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 okay. So, uh, after a little bit of fiddling around and a thumb through a guide, I totally forgot about this. A strange machine equipped with a lens. It looks like a projector. I wonder if we can put the this glass prism inside it. The answer, dear viewer, is yes, because I looked it up. Right. Okay, progress. Uh. Oh. Things have got fancy. Strange machine fit with the lens. Looks like a projector. A crystal was positioned inside. <laughs> right, okay. I think uh, we've got to turn the light off. Try that, and then shine our torch through it. So this is as much as I've read. I don't know what happens after this. Because I'm guessing we're going to get something. Like a projector. Do we have to use the torch? Perhaps? Is that the secret? Oh, right. We use it like an item. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Why did you try and stop me in my path, Father? You mustn't struggle against your fate. But you won't have died in vain. Your body is about to experience a new birth. The darkness blending into your blood will make you a stronger being. You will be faster. You will be a complete being. Oh, marvelously complete. First injection... Farewell, Father. Second injection. Welcome, new man. Ooh. So, get a new item. Um, right. So, <laughs> an engraved cube. Ah, uh, okay. 
Right, I mean, that, that's cool. Can't think of anywhere we've been where we need an engraved cube. Um... Oh! A small engraved metal cube. It is engraved library 3D map. Ah, yeah, that kind of does look like the library. Okay. So, Obed... No, it wasn't Obed, it was the other one. Alan is, like, injecting his dad with that funky green goop that uh, he was experimenting with. I mean, it doesn't seem like a very smart thing to do, but there we go, you know? That's what these uh, ladies and gentlemen seem to do in these games. They pervert the natural cause of things, you know? Right, let's go back. Uh, that was not a way... Actually, we can get to the library through this way. Duh. I would say the lay of the land is coming back to me, but I would be lying to you. So, I'm not going to say that, because this game is very confusing. Just the general layout. It's incredibly confusing. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm stupid. We know this. This is fact, but... I'm definitely having trouble navigating this place. Now. Where would we be able to use this 3D map in the library? Uh, okay, I mean... Hmm. Is there anything? Uh... I mean, there was that socket thing up here, but I don't, yeah, maybe we put this in there, but it does, doesn't make, oh, it doesn't make a huge amount of sense to me. In here, perhaps. Did we turn the lights out? We probably turned the lights out. I can't remember. I did do a little bit of running around off camera as well, so. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't think it's going to be that, but... Uh... No. Damn. Uh, okay. Okay. I doubt we can fiddle with that. We haven't... We must have missed something, because, like, I haven't seen any kind of socketed uh, item or pedestal, or switch, or uh, panel, or anything. So, there's got to be something glinting at us somewhere. There was, right. Okay, so we can do that there, right? Uh, we've got the desk. I don't think there was anything that we could really do with the desk. Is the... Let's have a look at this doohickey. Uh, engraved Q. Examine. One. Nine. Nine. Is that one nine nine? Seven? One nine nine. Could be. Ah, uh, it looks like one nine nine one. Ah, uh, but there is a flashy star thing. Uh, is there anything here that looks like it could be a flashy star thing? Could it be that? I mean, I'm guessing the flashy star thing is to give us context of which way around this cube is. But there is no flashy star thing, so... Yeah. Um, ah, wait, wait, wait. Do we have to go all the bloody way down and turn the light off? And then something's going to be, like, winking at us through the very shadows themselves. Maybe. Probably not. But maybe. You know. Worth a try, right? Uh... Why does it have to be so far down? I mean, don't get me wrong, Eileen here is getting a, a good workout, but uh, 
she doesn't look like she needs it, to be fair. You know, if I'm going to be honest with you. You know, she looks pretty trim. But then, everybody should exercise. It's good for you. Unless you go out and get hit by a bus or something. Yeah. Yeah, 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 maybe don't. Anything can happen when you leave the confines of your house. Uh, right, okay, let's turn this off. Now do I... Hang on, is there going to be something that glint on these? Well, I mean, that glints, but we know that. Is there something to fondle? Oh. Yeah, you see, shit glints up there. But I'm fairly sure I don't have a fucking clue what that is. To be honest. Uh, I think that's actually that glinting. But maybe it's some kind of emulator glitch? I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, so, let's keep looking. I mean, there doesn't appear to be anything here at all, if I'm being honest. There's nothing obvious, you know. Um, uh, is there anything around the desk? Oh, wait, hang on. Can we, like, put this cube in the statue? I mean, it doesn't make any sense. I'm going to say no. Nope. What about... Can't combine... Uh. Alright, smarty pants. Jesus, okay. I mean, these puzzles aren't exactly as... straightforward as Resident Evil. But that's okay, you know, we're... You know, remember when I said everybody needs exercise? I mean, you got to exercise your brain now and again. Hey, Jesus knows my brain needs some exercise. Fucking things asleep most of the time. Uh, definitely uh, need to exercise that head meat, for sure. Right. Stop medicating it with caffeine and uh, nicotine, I suppose. Oh, talking of caffeine. Well... Why, why ruin a habit of a lifetime, eh? Alright, cool, fine, whatever. Let's, I guess, go back upstairs. Do we need, like, another part to this cube? Is that, is, is that what this is about? Uh, otherwise, I'm going to make another cut of the video and I'm going to run around and try and find uh, uh, a cube. That is whole to put this, uh, no. We want to go. What do we? <laughs> I, I mean, we obviously need to put one of those doodads in there. I mean, it's, that's just, you know, obvious, but, uh, there's a, there's a snag with that, <clears throat> and that is that we don't actually have one of those. So, ah, Ah. Ah. No. Hmm. Well. This is, uh, this is a brain scratcher. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely not quite as into the puzzles. Like, cause there's no switches or buttons or anything. That's the thing. And there's nothing here we can manipulate. At all. Don't th well, obviously we've missed something, but nothing obvious. Right, gentle dudes, I will uh, have a little run around and see what I can find. Hey guys, okay. So, I'm still kind of stumped about this. Um, right, can't use it, examine. I mean, I've been all over upstairs. I've been out the window again. There's there's nothing, you know, 
Uh, so, okay. Unless that's something that we can find. Ah. Ah. What was the code? Nineteen nine. It was either nineteen ninety nine. Or 1997. One of the two. Hello? Oh, cool. Ooh. Secret passage. Right. Okay. Uh, I'm glad that worked because I couldn't really be asked to look at the guide again. Um, now, uh, I should really print that guide out. Oh, this is awkward. Do we have another thing to do? You take the Acanbis tablets. So we finally have them, two first aid kits, and a charm of saving. Fuck me, boys. Uh, right. Okay. So let's... Three carved bark tablets. The Abcanus information. Three of them, apparently. All right, carved in bark. That's pretty rad, actually. Right, uh, we've got a lot of these charms of saving. Uh, I guess we should use one, because I can't actually remember when we actually last proper physically saved the game. Um, so that's a thing. Right. Do you want to pull this lever? Uh, yes, probably. I don't know. Seems like a good thing to do. Ooh. Uh. Oh. Oh dear. That's bad. Holy shit, he's like a tyrant. I guess. Ah. Uh, Piss. I guess that's Obed Morton. No, not Obed Morton. Um, the dad. Uh, yeah. Oh, we got 50 fucking grenades. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. He moves. Okay. Was not expecting to do boss battle here. Can we turn the light on? Does that like weaken him? It does not weaken him. No, it does not. And he's just gonna... Can we aim at him, please? Thank you. He doesn't like that much. Right. Now, 